Welcome to my review of The Trumpet Major by Thomas Hardy. Hardy is mainly remembered for his dramatic tragedies, but he had a humorous side too, and The Trumpet Major is one of his novels that reflects his playfulness. In Festus Derriman, Hardy creates a wonderful pantomime villain, who is the source of much of the fun in the novel. Festus's uncle also provides plenty of laughs, and the novel is full of unlikely coincidences and humorous events. The novel is set against the backdrop of southern England at risk of imminent invasion from Napoleon's army. Thomas Hardy likely spoke to people who lived through that time, and the novel provides fascinating detail. In fact, the funniest part of the whole novel is when Festus thinks he'll have to face the French army landed on a nearby beach. The main subject of the novel is Anne Garland, and the men who caught her. Anne's fickle and off-changing affections power the story. It's not the greatest story Hardy ever told, but the atmosphere of England at risk of invasion is enthralling, and there's plenty of fun to be had with Festus, his uncle and other characters. I thoroughly enjoyed it. If you're interested in Thomas Hardy's playful side, then I can also recommend Under the Greenwood Tree and Two on a Tower. I believe that The Hand of Ethelberta also falls into this category, but I haven't read that one yet. The Trumpet Major is to be enjoyed for its historical detail, the characters it presents, and the fun to be had.